Okay, so I paced it off to 123 yards. Little six iron shot, pins on the right hand side. I'm gonna grip down just a tad, just to take away a little bit of momentum. I'm gonna toss it back about waist high. Let it fall through. What I'm trying to visualize here is the ball falling maybe 10 to 15 yards in front of the green, taking two hops and going onto the green. All right, I like it. That's felt like the right amount of momentum. Hold it right there. Okay, so that was pin high and just on the right hand side of the green. Let's go do that chip shot. Okay, so we have a little chip shot right here. So my distance control I'm very happy with. I hit that solid, just a little right of the pin. And as you can see, this is pretty standard chip shot. I'm gonna land it right on the front of the green and let it roll to the hole. My other um, uh, six iron shot was, you know, again, very, very solid as far as distance control. Um, just a little about 20 feet left of the pin. We'll put that in a sec. So I get in my posture. Weight forward, hands forward. Toss, fall. Toss, fall, all right? So I want just enough momentum to land it on the front of that green. So I take a practice swing, hold my finish. Look at the spot where I want to land it. And say, hey, was that too hard, not hard enough, or just right? That felt pretty good. So, toss, fall. Come on. Ooh. Almost made that. Okay, so I've lined up my putt. Basically the same thing here. If you feel that you're having a little bit of trouble letting it fall with the putter, so brace a little more weight on that left side, which is gonna bring your sternum a little more forward. Your, your putter is gonna hang right there in front of your sternum, right below your shoulders. Putter, the ball's gonna be just ahead of that. So you're gonna push it back with the left shoulder. It's a little mini toss, a toss, fall. Toss, fall. And we're just letting that putter fall through that ball. And we're letting the momentum go to the hole. We're not thinking about the ball going to the hole. We're thinking about the momentum taking the ball to the hole. Oh, that was right on line. Greens are a little slow, beginning of the season. <clears throat> Par four from the back tee, 406. Um, six iron off the tee, obviously. So let's see how far we can get this out there effortlessly, okay? So every time I step up to a tee box and I feel the need for speed, I wanna make sure I do it in an effortless manner, okay? I got a nice wind in the face. I'm gonna close the face a bit, play the ball a tad back in my stance. Toss, ball. So I'm letting it fall under the wind. Felt good. Now, effortless, powerful whip under this wind. Here we go. Toss, ball. Good strike. Nice and low. Excellent. So that got us out there. Oh, a good 180. So let's see if we can get that to the green. Actually, it might be a little more than that. We're a little downhill here. Let's go have a look. I guess I compressed that a little better than I thought. I got about 175 left. Thank goodness it's a little downhill off that tee box. So 175 into the wind. This is a nice little smooth six iron. Keep it under that wind. I'm in a little bit of a divot. That's all right, let's play it as it is. All right, effortless, nice toss. Let the momentum flow through the divot toward that target. Oh yeah, 
be the club. Right on the money. Beautiful. Doesn't get much better than that, apart from going in the hole, of course. So I just wanted to give you a view approaching the green here. I have a nice uh, double swale in this green. And uh, was lucky enough coming over there, I landed right on the hump and uh, we've got a nice little, it's a tester, but it's still, uh, it's gonna require some some work there we go this is what we got facing birdie so two six irons and we got a heck of a nice chance for birdie here so let's have a look so as you can hear that's my wife pinging me so i'm gonna get this done quickly for you guys line up my ball it's going to be a tad of a break to the right. It's uphill, it's slow. So I'm going to keep it inside the hole because it's uphill and slow. It's not going to break much and I got to be firm on this. So we make sure we got some nice momentum going to the back of the hole. So toss, fall, toss, fall. Is that enough momentum? No. Toss, fall, yes. All right, trust it. Toss, fall. Yes. So, combine that with the two easy pars we had on the last hole. There, one under par. So, uh, so tune in till next time. We'll uh, we'll do a little bit more of these during over the course of the summer. And in the meantime, uh, you know. The DVD is, uh, is chock full of amazing information. And uh, feel free to visit the website at seanclementgolf.com. You go to the YouTube page and you're gonna see, you know, a lot of videos out there. You know, they're, all compart uh, they're all in different compartments that, uh, that are easy to access. And then uh, if any of you want, to, want me to analyze your swing, I've got some new swing analysis um, services that you'll see on the swing analysis services page. Okay, we'll see you next time.